you're going to find that some of the sports they play in China are the same as in America and you're going to find that some are different. Some that are the same, for example, are basketball. Basketball is quite popular there. As you know, Yao Ming comes from China and so basketball is quite popular there. Also, soccer is a popular sport in China. Uh, however, baseball is virtually non-existent. I didn't see a single baseball field while I was there in China. I'm not talking about Taiwan. I'm talking about the mainland of China. Taiwan actually uh, has a lot of baseball. But in mainland China, there is no baseball. American football also does not exist. And you'll see that there are some other sports that we don't play much in, in America but are very popular in China. For example, badminton. I only remember playing badminton in high school in gym class and you don't really see any badminton courts around. But in China there are badminton courts around. You see a lot of people playing. It's one of the more popular sports there. Something else that's popular is ping pong. You can say, yeah, people play ping pong in America too. That's true. But for example, um, the last school I taught at in China had outdoor ping pong tables of some made of cement and there was just a huge row of them. Probably I'm going to estimate about 20 tables outside of ping pong tables. I mean, that's how uh, important ping pong is there in China. Uh, so ping pong is very important. Also pool, uh, playing pool billiards and snooker um, people like playing that swimming is fairly popular but it seems like they do a different kind of stroke when they're swimming it's kind of like like this one when you when you do it like this you push out like that and you kind of go like for long distance uh, swimming that's also popular in China. Now I found some people say oh Kung Fu or whatever in, from China but actually I Kung Fu is pretty rare in, in China from what I could see. I could be wrong you know there could be people but from what I saw there I was there for three and a half years and I went to many different cities in China I never saw a Kung Fu dojo or whatever you want to call it um, yes, there are places there when you can, where you can learn Kung Fu, that's true. However, there are far more martial arts places in America than there are in, in China. One thing that older people like to do is Tai Chi and uh, Qi Gong. And they do this, you'll just see when you're walking around, they'll be doing it in a park or on a street corner or something like this. You'll see them dressed in their outfits. Fishing is also somewhat popular depending on the location. People like to go fishing. And uh, jogging, not as much as America for sure. Uh, weightlifting, much less than America, but that is growing. There are more and more gyms popping up. And uh, I did go to gyms there. A lot of my coworkers went to gyms, and my brother-in-law has a gym there uh, in China. And so I think in China you can play some of the sports that you play in America, but also I think you'll have a lot of fun trying some of the sports that you didn't play so much when you were in America.